this amazing book is called Dustbin Baby by Jack and Wilson. Pearl rolled a tiny speck in her fingers, possibly a part of Rose's new leg that I tried so hard to make a good match. Pearl laughed and flicked it away as I let the snot out of her nose. I suddenly couldn't stand it. I rushed at her. She saw I wasn't playing around. She ran for it, but I caught up with along the landing. I punched her hard in the chest and she staggered backwards, back and back, and then she wobbled and went right over down the stairs. This is the quote I chose for my book. I chose this quote because it was descriptive and carefully explained. I also chose this quote because it had a simile and a lot of enthusiasm. So when April was a few minutes old, April was abandoned by her mother in a dustbin behind a pizza restaurant. She was discovered by a young lady there and named Abel by the hospital, as she was found on April's birthday. She was fostered by Patrick Williams, but only lived with her for a short time before being adopted. April's first stop on her 14th birthday was Pat's home. April's 14th birthday started out as a disappointment, as an old-fashioned foster mom didn't get her a cell phone. Upset, April skips school and goes looking for her former homes to know where she really came from and who she really is. The main characters in this book is April, Miss Bean, Poppy, Gina, Pearl, Big Mo, Frankie the Pizza Guy, and much more. April has a lot of nicknames. There's April showers because she always cries and April Fools because that's when her birthday was. And worst of all for her is Dustin Baby. I think that's because it is how her whole life got started. There is a film for Dustin Baby. The film theme is maternal bounding, bullying, and yacht crime. April didn't always have to great upbringing, being moved from home to home, and relationships that never seemed to last. The end is not such a happy ending as the reader might have wanted, but it's a happy ending for April as she comes to a realization of how grateful she is to have a wonderful foster mother and friends beside her.